I kind of want... I actually don't mind. They're all amazing. Right, let's go. It's a five. That's... 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 Hey guys, HTV here, and welcome to the first episode of our Pokemon Hard Gold Dice Log. Guys, I am so excited to be bringing this to you. I've been so, so looking forward to this, and I cannot believe it is finally here. If you guys are excited for this new series on the channel, please do smash that like button down below. Let's see if we can hit 300 likes on the first episode of this. But some of you guys probably like, hey, what's the Dice Log? Never heard of that before. I've been wanting to do this for so long on the channel. I'm going to go through all the rules. I've added some more spicy stuff in my pot of goodness. That's all going to happen. I will let you guys know as we get through this episode. But guys, the dice lock is super cool. It's so random and I am so excited to be bringing this to you guys. I'm so excited to go back to Johto as well. Hot Gold Soul, some of my favorite games. I was going to do Sacred Gold, Gold, but unfortunately, I couldn't randomize it. I tried for like hours. It just wasn't going well. And so I had to go down to Hot Gold. But it's still fine because these extra things that I'm adding into this game are making it just as difficult. But any guys, Without further ado, let's get into this guy. I'm so excited to bring this to you guys, but I hope you guys are excited. I've teased a little bit out of it in the Pokemon streams. You know, some of you guys might be catching on to what it could have been. But guys, let's get into this. I don't need any info. I've been Pokemon in five years. Don't need no information for this Let's Play. Yawn. What? It's already too late. No, I overslept. So I'm going to explain the rules after we go and have a good old conversation with our pal Professor Oak. He can't just skip past this man. He's been there since Red and Blue days. Anyway, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Oak, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things you should know about this world. What do I need to know, Professor Oak? This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. Aight, what we got going on then? We got a map. I hope it's randomized. I hope it's randomized. I did click that randomized button. I hope it hasn't messed up on me. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together, and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. Cool, as we all know by now. Now, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Are you a boy or are you a girl? Won't you please tell me? If you insist, Oak, I'm a boy. I'm standing right in front of you. I hope it'd be easy to tell that. So you're a boy then. I am. I am a boy. Please tell me your name. I, okay, well, I've got to call you. It's just right on the channel name, pal, but it's HDV. Got to get that pronunciation right, you know. Let's go there. Lowercase, I'm looking fresh out here. HDV, here we go. Boom, talking about it. Your name is HDV? It sure is, my pal. HDV, are you ready? Your very own tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. Fun experiences, difficult experiences, there's so much waiting for you. Dreams, adventure, let's go to the world of Pokemon. I'll see you later. Okay guys, so the juicy part, the part you've all been waiting for, the dice lock rules. Of course, these all will be in the description down below, but we'll do a quick overview of it right now. So basically, what is a dice lock? A dice lock is the same as a Nuzlocke, so basically if I lose a Pokemon, I can only catch the first Pokemon every round. If I lose a Pokemon, I've got to put it in the PC, everything like that. But every time I find a new encounter, I have to roll a six-sided dice. When I have rolled that, that Pokemon that I found is assigned the number it was rolled. So it can be a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. So let's say I catch an Eevee, and I roll it, and it's a 3. So I've got a 3, and that 3 is assigned to Eevee. I can only use 1, 1 Pokemon, 1, 2 Pokemon, 1, 3 Pokemon. So if I catch the Eevee, it's a 3. It's the third slot in my team. If I go and find another encounter, and I roll again, and let's say it's a roll, and I get a 3 again... I can't use both of those in my team because they're both assigned a three. So I can only have, like I say, one, 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 two, one, three, one, four. So by the time you get through the game, you should really have like a, a one, a two, a three, four, five, a six. Or if you're lucky like me, I'll probably have like 20 sixes and I can only use one Pokemon in my team the whole time. But guys, that's the normal dice lock rules. However, I've added another twist on it, as you can see by my professional notepad document right here. So basically, after rolling, so I can assign like the Eevee the three, say that happens, I have to roll again. After that, this is the, the spicy part of it. So if I get a 1 on the second roll, I can't catch it and I have to move on. So even if I've assigned a 3 to that Eevee, I just gotta move on. I can't catch it. It's gone. Bye Eevee, no, come back, but it's gone. If I roll a 2, I have to look for another encounter and then roll this one again. So it's still assigned the 3, I just have to roll the different encounter again. If it's a 3 or a 4, I can just catch it normally. If it's a 5, I can catch it, but I can only use one Pokeball. That's not like just one Pokeball. I can use like an Ultra Ball or a Great Ball. I'm only allowed to use one ball to try and catch it. And if I roll a 6, I get to re-roll it if I want to or just catch it normally. So if I find a really bad encounter, I can re-roll this again to see if I get like a 2 or something or you know, something else. So I can re-roll that encounter, which is really cool. But that is pretty much the rules, guys. Like I say, we'll all be in the description down below because there's quite a lot to take in there. But uh, 
hopefully it will become more like easy to understand as we go through the game but obviously let's just see how it goes but i'm super excited about this it's quite difficult as i like if i can find a really good encounter there's, there's no like reason I can't roll a 1 straight after, which is why like, I couldn't catch it. Which is why this extra dice element, which is why it's so random, is so cool. But anyway. Hi, HV. You're finally awake. I I'm overslept. Your friend Lyra was just here. She was playing hide-and-seek with her Meryl. Oh, I almost forgot. Our acquaintance, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said I had a favor to ask of you. You know where the lab is, right? It's right next door to us. By the way, do you have everything you need to go out? Here, use this bag to carry things. This is your trainer card. Here you can save a record of your progress. These are also rather helpful. Just try touching the buttons and you'll know what to do in no time. Sweet. Thanks, mother. I'm going to change that tech speed to fast because I'm not about that slow life. Give me that battle scene. Do I put set or shift on? I'll put a shift on because it's already difficult with the dice lock rules. Um, what frame should we have? Should we change up a bit? I'm going to change it. I'm going to change it. Oh, I like that orange. Yes. Hot gold orange. It's got to be done. It looks nice and powerful. But here we go, guys. We're off. For my star Pokemon, by the way, they are going to be assigned the number one because it's the first Pokemon I get. And I'm also, what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll a dice. And then basically, if it's a one or two, I have to choose the first slot. If it's a three or four, I have to choose the second slot. And if it's a five or six, I have to choose the last spot. This is why there's no choose your star episode. It's all down to look from the get-go, guys. I'm all about that dice master play now. You know, dungeon dice monsters eat, dungeon dice monsters eat your heart out. Here we go, though. First Pokemon. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm hoping it's not trash. I'm hoping it's not trash. Let's see what happens, though. Right. Hi, HV. I've been waiting for you. Do you know anything about my research? As you know, Pokemon are carried in Pokeball these days. But people, but before the Pokeball was invented, people used to walk with Pokemon, just like your friend Lyra does. Pokeballs are great because you can carry many Pokemon. But walking with Pokemon must have some advantages. I, it could have something to do with how Pokemon grow or evolve. So I'm going to give you a Pokemon. Can you walk beside this Pokemon outside of his Pokeball to see if this brings any special feelings or bonds between Pokemon and people? The device over there has some Pokemon you could choose from. Deling, deling. My boy Elm's got that phone call. Oh, hey, I got... Oh, an email. Oh, uh, uh-huh, okay. Hey, listen, I have this acquaintance the people call Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and railing about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It's probably another Pokemon egg, but we're still so busy with our Pokemon research. Wait, I know. You can go in our place, right? Can we count on you? You can choose one of the Pokemon over there. Okay, here we go then, guys. Right, how do I do this? Do I roll first and see what I could have got? Or do I see what I can get and then roll? I'm going to look what I can get and then I'm going to roll. Okay, so these are the options, guys. Okay. A Weavile. Oh, Black and White Snow. He's back. If you didn't watch Black and White Snow, literally clutched that Let's Play. We got a, a Rhydon and a Latios. Bruh, I don't even mind. All of these are literally amazing. Okay, but guys, this is all down to chance. So Weavile is one or two, Rhydon is three or four, and then Latios is five or six. Huh. Oh, so this dice I'm, I'm using, this app, I can't get it down to one die for some reason, so we're just going to look at what the pink one says. So this is going to be the dice we roll. Okay. I kind of want... I actually don't mind. They're all amazing. Right, let's go. It's a five. That's Latios. That's Latios! That's Latios! <laughs> That's Latios, right? Weavile was one or two. Rhydon was three or four. Latios was five or six. I'm liking my look already. I'm liking it. I'm liking my look already. I will take it. I will take that Latio. Look at it. It's beautiful. It's I'm so excited. Oh my lord. We actually got a Latio. We didn't just get the randomizer to randomize it as Latios. We got that dice as well. Moon number five. I would like to give my Latios a nickname. Of course I would. Right. Okay. Um. What do I call it? A Latios. Um. I'm gonna call it Draco. Uh, I can't believe this look already. This is the most insane starter Pokemon I've ever had in my. Those choices were wild though. I wouldn't have mind a Weavile because of how amazing Snow was in black and white. A Rhydon's cool because I would have got a Rhyperia. And then a Latios. I mean, you can't really. You can't really be angry at those choices. They were all insane. Alright, I've got Draco and the Latios. I don't know what Latios' level moves are. But it looks powerful, follow me right there. How do you like walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, 
He ain't getting hurt, pal. I'll just clutch this whole playthrough with my boy Latios. Don't worry about that. You should heal it with this machine. It's so easy to use just to check the PC on my desk. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, HDV. Bruh. I've just realized the rival could have the Weavile or the Rhydon and he carries it through the game. Weavile is literally such a check for my Latios. That is bad. That is kind of bad. Or will he check Ro Even if he gets Rhydon, Rhydon's still going to be annoying to take on. Oh my lord. My, my rival's even got powerful Pokemon. He could have had a Latios though. <laughs> he could have had a Latios, man. I want you to help have, have these to help with your task. Thank you. I'm going to need them when Weavile starts ice punching my brains out. Pokemon are weak in the beginning. <laughs> I don't think you've seen this Latios behind me, pal. Don't hesitate to use a potion if you think yours is in danger. Let's check out my, my Latios. Let's check out my Latios. Oh, what's, what's your nature, pal? Naive nature. Psywave and heal block. Psywave. I can't, I can't touch Weavile. I can't, can't touch Weavile. <laughs> I legitimately can't touch Weavile. Bro, where did you tackle that, man? Where's Dragon Clora? I, I can't touch Weavile. Has he picked Weavile? Let's see, the last slot would have been Totodile. I'm not sure, you know. I actually have no idea. HDV, so you picked a Latios. That's a cute Pokemon you have. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes, too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? See ya. I really hope my rivals not pick that, 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 that Weavile, dude. I literally can't touch it. Weavile only has Scratch at the start. I knew that from Snow when I had him. But he can hit me. I can't. Hey, how you doing, mom? Oh, HTV, that's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor O must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task for you, you say. What kind of task? I see. That sounds a little difficult. But when someone makes that kind of request for you, it must be important. Oh, that's right. I completely forgot. Your Pokegear came back from the repair shop. Here you go. Bro, I'm still in a sense of, like, I'm scared. I don't know if he's going to have Weavile. It's what every trainer should have. Guess what? You can use the Pokegear to make a phone call, too. Do you remember how? I do. Thank you for asking, though, mother. You're gonna tell me anyway, I Just power on the Pokegear and touch the telephone button, okay? The names of the people you can call are automatically re registered. Just select one to give him or her a call. I can't English right now, apparently. I'm just so excited and also scared at the same time. Well, I can't believe it's so easy to make a phone call. Bruh. Ladios. Oh, my lord. I just realized I don't have the speed-up button in this game. Maybe it is here, I just don't know what it is. That's okay. The speed-up button gets me destroyed every time. Wait one second. I, bro, I can't believe you just give me a Latios, dude. You're you're now my favorite professor. I almost completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. All right, get your digits in my phone, Elm. I'll call you if anything comes up. All right. Thing is, I kind of need to catch a new Pokemon. I'm literally screwed if I can't. Because if I come up against a Dark type, I lose. I can't do anything about that. So, good thing is there's quite a few encounters around this area. Obviously, there's one here, there's one up, there's one near Mr. Pokemon's house. There's like three or four encounters around here, and that is a powerful Bastiodon. I'd be okay with that. Look how powerful it looks. Okay, I might actually kill this. No, it's, it's gonna take ages to kill, isn't it? We got away safely, though. So that, that's the first option. That's very, very nice. I'm all about a Bastiodon real quick. Yes, please. A C-Dot? Maybe not. Maybe not at all. Bruh! Look at that powerful my Latios is. I just need, like, a find a TM or something that's, like, I don't know, like, Dragon Force or something. Just saying it's not trash, man. I'm, gonna, I'm definitely gonna have to find out what the speed button is. Maybe it's not on my emulator. I'm not too sure. Let's carry on trucking, though. Let's keep going. Not sure how I feel about that. I just need I just need a Pokemon. I just need another Pokemon. Even a C Dot. Actually, no, C Dot would be trash against um the the Weavile. I don't know if he's got Weavile. Even if he's got Rhyme, it's gonna be difficult. But he's gonna have a Rhyperia. 
Like, my rival's gonna be difficult to fight every time, which I'm actually glad about. I'm glad he's not got, like, a Pidgey or something. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay, everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I could teach you a few things. Okay, then. Follow me. Pardon me. I need to find the speedo button. I don't think I have it. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot that you weren't wearing the running shoes. I'll try to go as slow as possible, so try keeping up. This is a Pokemon. I mean, we don't need to we don't need to listen to this jibber jabber, do we? Well, let's be honest. But guys, like I say, the dice lock is taking effect. So Latias is a Latios is a one. So the thing is, man, I could easily roll ones on all of these encounters. One is a bad number right now. If I roll a one on the first encounter, it's bad because I can't even put in my team. And if I roll like a good number like four, and I roll a one from my own personal things, I can't even catch it. So I literally need a two, and then like a three or a four. Kind of thing. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do this, you know. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to hop like... <sighs> I got them running shoes though. Alright, okay, that's going to speed my game up a little bit. I'm a scared. You leave me alone, old man. <sighs> I made it. I forgot about one thing. There's another token from me. Take it. Thank you. I would rather you give me the speed up button, but it's fine. Okay, we got the Poke here. Nice, nice. All right. Yeah, I need to go on my adventure, man. We need to catch a first Pokemon. You know what I mean? I also need to figure out if my... Oh, what's this item? Give him those glasses. Oh, you're looking nice and powerful now. Like, choice specs. First item is a choice specs. First item, choice specs. Just realized I'm gonna have to say that off though when I'm actually doing the encounter so I don't overkill. So I'm now Latios with choice specs. I don't want your apricorns. I've picked up my choice specs. I put him on my Latios. He's now the coolest looking Latios in all the land. And I gotta beat my rival. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. That's the thing. Right, let's see what the oh, choice band right up there. That's the master ball right there. I'm calling it right now. If I can catch a fear. It's not great, but it would be good at this point. Bro, if my first Pokemon are a legendary and a mythical, this is gonna be easy. How much is this? That, why didn't that do anything? Did I get the lowest roll of Psy Wave ever? I mean, I have choice. Does Choice Specs affect? I don't think Choice, face, choice Specs affect Psy Wave. I've only got one move anyway, so it's not even like it matters. Why is this doing nothing? Latios. I feel like you're getting really, really low rolls on the Psy Wave, and I don't like it. Bloop, bloop, bloop. There we go. That's a bit more damage. More about that damage. Okay, I send him now. Just trying to get that XP, you know. Obviously, it doesn't take it into account. Oh, that's a nice damage hit there. That was right. How much? Seventy. That's not great. Okay, a nice half of my XP bar. Let's just pick up this master ball real quick. Can someone, like, get the chances of that happening? Bruh, if we get a choice by now, um, I'm quitting the LP because it's cursed. How lucky have we been already? Choice Scarf, Choice Specs, and a Latios. I don't even know anymore. You must be HDV. It was I who sent an email to Professor Elm earlier. Okay. I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm sorry, I've just picked up the best items and got the best Pokemon ever, I'm just saying. This is what I want Professor Realm to examine. A mystery egg. A friend of mine from Agruti gave it to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg in Johto. I thought Professor Realm might be able to tell what this is. 
He's the best when it comes to research of Pokemon Evolution. That's a quote from the professor's prefer no, the famous Professor Oak. Well, returning to Professor Realm, here your Pokemon should have some rest. Thank you. Oh, I can't wait to get Pokeballs. Oh man, have I got a story for you? <laughs> that was they won't do that again. And with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So you're HDV. I was just visiting my friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Realm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. <laughs> You're right it is. I see, you must be helping Professor Realm's research. I think I understand why Professor Realm gave you that Pokemon. You will treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. This, this episode has all kind of hype. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. HTV, I have a feeling that this is not the last time we'll, we'll, we'll meet. Let's exchange numbers, just to be on the safe side. Why the jingles? Okay. Alright. Despite all that rival, let's see what he's got for me. Oh, Professor Oh, his robbery has happened, hasn't it? Hello, HTV. It's a disaster. It's just terrible. What should I do? Oh no, please get back here now. Click. Alright. I mean, if you've got a Weavile, this is your own problem. I ain't dealing with that. No, sorry, am I dealing with that. So, so far in this grass, I've found a fear. And a Mammoth Swine? These encounters are ridiculous. Like, legitimately ridiculous. A Mammoth Swine. What even is that, man? I kind of want to get my Pokemon to level 6. So I'm going up against the Rhydon or a Weavile. I mean, if I, if I go up against the Weavile, it doesn't even matter because I legitimately just cannot do anything about it. Geodude, I can take you out. Easy. You're, you're, you're my... He's, you're, you're Draco's supper, dude. He's like, oh yeah, no, 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 get me that. Get that in my belly. I'm all about that. Blue, blue, blue. So High Wave is just such a horrible move to use. As you can see right now, though. I don't know when I learn another move. Which is great. Not, by the way, that was sarcastic. It's not great at all. It does get some good damage in at some point, so it just depends. I don't think Choice Specs affects. So this first Pokemon that I have to catch has to be the most clutch special attacking Pokemon out there. But, I mean, this guy's just a fence curling all day. I don't think I'm going to get 70 XP from this thing, though. At all. Blub, 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 blub. Oh, come on, man. Side wave isn't getting any high rolls for me. It's stab, man. I don't think choice specs affects, which is why it's not doing much. Blue, 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 blue. Got a kill. Thank you. Give me that level up, please. 31. Almost pointless. I feel like I should level up once, though. I need to check when Latios learns another move, because, like... And the Mammoth Swine. This thing's going to give me loads of XP, but it's only level 2. It's probably going to have an ice move for me that's going to just body me, but... It's gonna give me some XP, so. Only level 2 as well. Come on, just get a high roll. I need to learn how to do the speed of button. I'm not sure where it is. I don't think you can actually do it on this um, emulator, though. I might have to download another emulator real quick. Right, okay. Heck. <clears throat> 2 damage. I Definitely gotta heal up, though, because I am running out of side waves. Oh, come on, it's doing literally nothing every time. I'm getting such a like a low. It can do like it can have like a decent base power. I know that. Yeah, that's good. That's what I'm talking about. I don't know how I'm gonna take out the Rhydon though. If it is a Rhydon, could be a Weavile. If I, like I say, if it's a Weavile, I lose. Unless I learn another move right now. Please, you probably won't. But I would beg that you do. Nope. So we're stuck with Sci Wave, guys. We're stuck with as you say Wave. Let me heal up. Take on the rival. And I'm, I'm probably going to do an encounter this episode because I'm looking forward to that. Oh la 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 la. Got like yours. Fly up into Nurse Joy's, you know, counter. You'll be good to go. Booda kooda booda goo. Nice. Watch, I know what's going to happen. I'm going to get really low rolls on all the fights. And then when I get a really good encounter, I'm just going to get like the highest roll and it's just going to destroy it. I love this rival music. 
You got a Pokemon at the lab? What a waste. That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Please let me Weavile. Please let me Weavile. Please let me Weavile. Please let me Weavile. Weavile. <laughs> this all comes down to this. Don't you dare. I'm. Don't have a Weavile. <sighs> okay, we got a chance. We got a chance. He has a ride on there. That's gonna become a Zyparia soon, man. Damage? Oh, yes. Fury attack. Uh oh, we in for a problem right now. Don't you dare get five, man. Okay, three is okay. Side wave time. Some good damage here. Oh, yes. Respectable. Tail whip's coming through right now. Latios versus a Rhydon. You're doing okay for someone weak. You're right now. You got this legendary side wave coming at you. Some good damage here. Ooh, I'm liking it. Another tail whip. And then one more side wave should take out the Rhydon, which is good. We got some good high rolls on this fight, which is good stuff. But there goes the Rhydon. 217. Boost me to level 7. Boom! Give me another move. Please, I'm begging you. Bruh, that was a lot of XP from a Rhydon. Are you happy you won? Give me that Moonaze. Give me that Moonaze. You want to know who I am? I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Bye, have a nice time. Oh. Oh, he dropped his trainer card, didn't he? Give it back! That's my trainer card! Oh no, you saw my name! I have no idea what I'm going to call my rival. Probably just silver. Or gold. I don't even know. But we're going to definitely get an encounter this episode, guys, just to start things off. Because why not, right? We've got to get the first encounter, just see what the team's looking like. Okay. Um, right, okay. Um, let's go back up to the lab then. See what uh, good old Professor Elm Elm has happening to him. Who are you? We are investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Rule number one, whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it. No. Hold on a second, he has nothing to do with it. I saw it, there was a red-haired boy looking into the building. Dum, 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 dum. What, you battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get his name? I did. Uh, I'm gonna just call him... I'm just gonna call him Silver, because that's who he is, you know? Uh... Lowercase... Silver... Oh! Imagine if that was what I had to call it. Imagine if I spell it wrong, that'd be kind of wild. Right, Silver. For some reason I thought Silver had two L's in for some second, I don't know why. Uh, I see, so Silver was his name? It was. Thanks for helping my investigation. My next assignment is a search for the red-haired individual. Which you're never going to find, apparently, because you are the one uh, police officer in the whole of Johto, apparently. Hey, Shri, I'm glad that you understand you are innocent. See you later. Bye. Uh, hey, Shimmy, this is terrible. Oh, yes, what was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Here's this egg. Do we get it right now? Oh, this is an egg, isn't it? This egg may be something I've never seen. Still, it's just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well find out what secret it holds. I'll keep it for a while to find out about the egg. What? Pro Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? Is that true? That's incredible. He is superb at seeing the potential of po people as trainers. Oh, HV, I knew you were a little different. Things are gonna be fun. Your Pokemon seem to really like you, so why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? You manage to feed all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon League champion. Or not. Uh, becoming the champion is not at all easy, but you can certainly challenge Violet City's gym. I, HV, challenging the gym scattered around will be a long journey. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. I still gotta buy Pokeballs, really? That's annoying. Let's talk to her old mother bear. See what she's saying. Hey, I'm just about to leave on a journey, never see you again, bye. So you're leaving on an adventure? Okay, I'll help too, but what can I do for you? I know, every time you, re you receive prize money, I'll save some of it for you. On a long journey, money's important. Do you want me to save your money for you? Hells no. Okay, but be careful out there. Yeah, okay, bye. Goodbye. Now I'm gonna get some hockey balls. Wait, do I have some? I don't have some, right? Just got to check. There's my choice scarf. No, I don't have any. Okay, so I've got to go buy some, then we're going to get an encounter, and then we're going to finish off the first episode, which is going to be wild. Oh, oh no, she gives me a Pokeball. That's all good. There you are. 
I only had the space ball right now. You can catch wild Pokemon with Pokeballs. Follow me. Okay. Ba la 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 la. Do da la da la 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 la. Nice. Just like that. Huh? Was I too fast? I'll try again. Come this way. There's no point, man. Just let me just decide whether I want to see you battle anything or not. Because I'm not Pokemon, you know? Bala. Sorry, guys. I had an interruption there. I tried to uh, find the speed up button and I ended up pausing the game. So that's not great. I'm just trying to find the speed up button. I know it's space bar, but. Yeah, so I don't seem to have it. Uh... Nope. Paused it again. Okay. I'll just find out, like, if it's the emulator or not, but... I mean, we don't need the speed up button. It's useful when I'm grinding and stuff, but, like... I don't know. It's fine. Oh, la, 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 la. One. Two. Three. Psh. Oh, la, 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 la. Now, that rat is about to get boxed for Hall of an Eternity. La, la, la. I'm so excited about this Pokemon, though. So excited about this. See? Just like that. It's better to lower your target's HP more than I did, or make it sleep or something. You can try all kinds of things to see what works. I'll give you these. Good luck. Thanks, Lyra. Always liked you for a reason, pal. See you. Here we go, there, guys. Ooh, the first encounter. So we're gonna we're gonna find the encounter. Then we're gonna roll twice. Yes. Literally couldn't be worse. Literally couldn't be worse. I gotta hope for that too, man. Right, we're rolling. The pink one. It's a three, so three is assigned to Wormpool, so it's gonna be in the number three spot. Then let's roll again. Okay, I'm hoping for a six or a two right now. It's a three, so I can catch it normally. Okay, so <sighs> things happen, you know. This is the number three Wormpool. Watch me Oko it. Don't. Okay, sweet. So I can catch it normally. It's not awful. I mean, it, we guaranteed the Pokemon. It's just it's a level two Wormpool. It's a level two Wormpool. I almost want to do another encounter. I might do another encounter on the way. Now nah, I'll leave that for next episode. It'll be more exciting. But let's just catch the Wormpool. Get it in our team. <sighs> okay. That's okay. He, he might come through. You never know. She might come through and just destroy everything. Do you want to give a name to Wormpool? Yes. Um, so we've got number one and number three so far. What should I call a Wormpool? Um, let's call it Swarm. I usually call Swarm my book Pokemon. Shout out to the ex Egglock that just finished. Uh, swarm. Hey, choice scarf wormpool. It's what I'm about. It's what I'm about. Check it out though. We got we rock him. Impish nature. What's that? Defense down, special attack. No, no. Defense over special attack down. Okay, shield dust as well. All right. Okay, so we got swarm out here. But guys, that is gonna be everything for the first episode. I really, really hope you guys did enjoy. It. I had a lot of fun uh, with this episode. We had a lot of ups and downs right now. Uh, a lot of ups and downs. If you guys did enjoy that, remember to leave a like down below. Really just about the stream, uh, the, the stream, the video, the channel, all that good stuff. And remember, let's try and hit 300 likes for the first episode. Remember my second channel, Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, channel, Discord, Patreon, all of that can be found in the description down below as well if you want to check any of that out. That is it from me though, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Have an amazing rest of your day. And until next time, guys, peace.